Hey guys, it's Greg from Vanguard Motor Sales. Man, look what I got for you today. A 1968 Chevelle. The chrome on the front bumper's looking sweet. I love the color on this thing. I call that strawberry red. But the white stripes are looking sweet and she is absolutely gorgeous. As you look down the side of the car, straight as an arrow, that is just some beautiful paint. Gorgeous car, then check out that interior. It's got the pearl interior in it, isn't that cool? Super cool for you guys who live in those states where it gets 125 degrees out and they're worried about sitting on a black seat. Of course, my favorite color is black, but I understand that whole heat thing. We got a great looking steering wheel on there. We got a set of gauges down there underneath the dash. We got a Hurst shifter and a center console. The carpeting's looking sweet. She is a beauty. Got great looking vinyl on the seats. We got seat belts in the front and in the rear. You gotta strap those kitties in. One great looking car. And what's cool about these uh, 68s is you can actually tell by the VIN whether it was a Super Sport or not. The 138 in the VIN tells you that. See the reflections in the paint? Man, that looks good. We got great looking chrome on the back. And I tell you a little secret, my quick telltale sign to tell it's a 68 is when that tail light wraps around. On a 69, the tail light's just in the back. These stripes are also looking sweet. The stripes are got a little bit of a pearl look to them too. There's a little bit of metallic in the stripes. Inside the trunk, it looks like a brand new car. Make sure you always pull up the mat, look underneath the mat, check out that trunk floor. Look in the gutter system here. Take a look uh, what kind of time they spent painting the bottom side of the deck lid. You can see they took the time to take the latch out. They did, uh, looks like a fairly new rubber here. As you look down that passenger side, she's straight as can be. We're gonna get out and drive this thing in a second and we're gonna have some fun. Chevelle for a ride. Don't you just love the exhaust on a big block? I tell you what, a good dual exhaust and some good mufflers on a Chevelle with a big block, there's nothing funner than that. Pull into a car show with that baby rumbling, you're gonna turn every head in the crowd. So if you want this dream parked in your driveway, you just call Tom at 248. 974-9513. Tom will go through the whole process, just how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. I tell you what, she just sounds amazing. Driving great, power steering feeling good, brakes feeling good, accelerator feels the best. I tell you what, this her shifter in my hand feeling good. I tell you what, this is one sweet machine right here, guys. Love the color on it. Like I said earlier, those uh, stripes have got a little bit of pearl. You can just see the sun dancing off of them, looking sweet. So she's up shifting good, she's down shifting good. You can see down here on the dash, a real simple gauge setup on these. We just have the speedo here on the left. Then we got a nice tack right here in the middle. Then we got three nice big gauges down there underneath the dash telling you what your voltage, your oil pressure, and your water temp is. It does look like it's got a retro sound radio in it. Of course, I don't listen to radio when I'm driving a hot rod. 
I listen to the music that I'm playing out of those dual exhausts. Now we are close to the airport here in Detroit if you need to fly in and check this baby out in person. We do sell most of our stuff sight unseen. So come on in, check it out in person. We'd love to have you. If you want to send an inspector, no problem. We'll treat the inspector just like we treat you. And right now we're heading back to the main facility so we can put this baby up on the rack so you can check out the bottom. Now at Vanguard, we're one of the only companies in the nation that puts every one of their cars up on the rack. We are proud of the bottom of every one of our cars. Now here's our main facility here at 15100 Keel Street. So stick with me. We're gonna go in the air with this one right now. All right, we're underneath this 68 now, and man, it is pretty under here. As you can see, it's got a new tank. You gotta look at the trunk floor in every car that you're gonna buy. You can see that it's got new body bushings here. We got good looking uh, exhaust here. It's not brand new, but it's definitely fairly new. Uh, we got a 12 bolt rear end. It's got a 275 gear and it is an open rear end. So it's a great highway gear. So if you plan on putting some miles on this baby, that's the rear end for you. We got brand new uh, disc brakes out back. You can see the whole kit's all brand new, looking good. Uh, lower control arms look like the bushings are fairly new here. The upper control arms look the same. Everything under here is nice and clean. It's got Flowmaster mufflers. You can see that the floorboards are in good shape. You always want to look here. You always want to look at these uh, dog legs in the frame also. Make sure those are in good shape. You can see I've, I see a brand new brake line here. I see what looks like a fairly new uh, fuel line going front to back. It's got a M21 uh, four-speed trans here. So that's uh, very, very close to what would have been in the car originally. It's got jet coated headers. It's got a stock appearing bell housing. It's got stock appearing um, clutch linkage there. Uh, it looks like it's got a high torque starter. So that's an upgrade. Um, up front here also, the brakes look like they've been upgraded to disc. Looks like it's got new ball joints in it too. Everything's cleaned up and painted real nice. The idler arm, a lot of the steering gear looks like it's new. Sway bar bushings look like they're new. Front frame horns are nice and straight. Core support's in good shape. You can see that the bumper looks like it's new chrome. And then the wheels and tires. Got great looking uh, American Racing torque thrusts here. Uh, they're all chromed up looking good. Let's see, there's the size 245-60-15s up front. As you work your way down the side there, you can see that they spent the time to paint it right down to the bottom edge of the rocker. That pinch weld's looking good. Now out back here, we got 255-60-15s. Uh, and again, you can see those drilled and slotted rotors through those beautiful wheels. Now let's get under the hood and check out the 396. All right, under the hood here, we got 396 power. You can see it's got a great looking air cleaner on it. Looks like it's got an aluminum intake. It's a performer RPM intake. We got great looking valve covers on there. The master cylinder's been chromed up. It does have a power booster. So that's telling us it is power brakes. Let's see what's underneath there. It looks like a Holley carburetor. That is a four barrel. It is a dual feed. It is a single pumper. Uh, you can see all these nice fuel lines that have been made for it. It's got MSD wires. Looks like it's got a billet distributor. It's got an MSD coil and an MSD 6AL box is what's making the fire. Looks like a brand new AC Delco battery here. They've put a new chrome um, top here that holds the radiator in. It is a cross flow radiator. Uh, looks like the pulleys, the power steering pump, and the water pump are all chromed up also. So she's looking good under the hood. Looks like a brand new fan shroud here. The inner wheelhouses are nicely painted. You can see they took the paintwork on the fenders right down into the uh, engine compartment here. Also the firewall and all the wiring is looking nice and neat. Bottom side of the hood is nice and clean. They've replaced the fiberglass under the hood here. I mean, everything about this car is cool, guys. She's a 68, she's got a big block in her, and a four speed, and it's one beautiful color. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this dream in your driveway.